Willkommen zurück zu einer weiteren Folge Sherlock Holmes. Wir spielen den nächsten Fall, denn ich habe Lust drauf. Lasst uns überraschen, wo es endet. Mit dabei der altbekannte Gabe. Zwischen Fall 2 und Fall 3 muss ich ehrlich sagen, habe ich jetzt eine Woche Pause gemacht und aufnehmen, denn meine Kiddies waren hier. Und wenn meine Kinder da sind, nehme ich nicht auf. Das ist sehr selten. Holmes, was passiert? Ich fühle mich tödlich. Und du siehst es. Lass mich dich sehen. Bitte sag nicht, dass du deine alten Gewohnheiten zurückgekehrt hast. Oh wow, wir äh, spielen mal seinen äh, Kollegen. Interessant. Ist okay. The äh. temperature sure. appears to be normal. I need to concentrate and count the heartbeats. I need to... Wow. A weak pulse. Around 50 beats per minute. Ich weiß nicht, was das heißt. But you're dying, Holmes. Your pulse rate is dropping. We need to get you to the hospital immediately. The antidote. <laughs> Give it to me. The antidote? Gengish. You mean that you're poisoned? No. Please. Here, drink it all. Don't tell me that you did this to yourself. Hemlock and the Tura. I was compelled to. Holmes, imagine if I'd not returned home when I did. What might have happened? I knew that you would. Mr. Holmes, Inspector Lestrade is here to see you. Mr. Holmes is unable to see anyone at the moment. He is unwell. A good day, Inspector. Ah, Mr. Holmes, <laughs> I'm glad to find you here. I need your help. This is a strange one. We have brought in two young bankers from the city, sons of lords, members of the chamber, and so on and so forth. They were found stranded in a rowing boat that was drifting on the Thames. A romantic escapade with an unhappy ending, Lestrade. What? Well, yes, they were both in the bath, but... Uh, what? <laughs> As I said. <laughs> and they were tied together. You are lacking in imagination, Inspector. Well, no, I'm not. Anyway, there was a banner flapping about in the boat with the RMS Oceanic printed on it and signed by the Merry Men. The Oceanic? Isn't that the largest steamer ever built? Yes. And these two young banker chaps are sons of the owners of the White Star Line, the company that built it. There are rumors of corruption. I'm not interested in politics, Lestrade. I'll keep it then. Here's another one that's a bit more complex and maybe to your liking. It's a murder, but we're unable to find any weapon. We haven't touched anything. It's at the Roman Baths in Strand Lane. A murder, a vanishing weapon, the Roman Baths. That's for us. Watson, fetch your hat. Ja, weiter geht's. Wie gesagt, es war eine Woche Ruhe dazwischen. Ich muss selber erst einmal sehen, wie ich hier wieder weiterkomme. Treffe sich auf das Draht, bla bla bla.
beautiful place. With a dreadful murder. The body of Sir Rodney Bentcliffe is still in the steam room. It has not been touched, per your usual instructions, Mr. Holmes. I shall be waiting for you here, but please hurry. Are you able to identify the men who were with the victim in the steam room? Yes. The manager of the bath, Sir Gregory Pitkin, a lad from the city council, Garrow, and an archaeologist by the name of Blinkhorn. I think the plump one, Garrow, did it. He doesn't seem right in the end. Well, we shall see. You found no murder weapon? No, and that's why I called you. All three witnesses and the victim were locked in when the murder occurred, and they remained so until we got here. We even had to pick the lock to enter. I see. Was there anyone else here, apart from those gentlemen in the steam room? Yes, a Mr. Phillips. He was the one who called the police. He will be able to give you more details. Okay. Uh... What was that then? Eh? Finde die Tatwaffe. Oh Gott. Frigidarium. Are the steam rooms on the other side, Mr. Holmes? Okay. Ex Exitus. <lacht> Sudatorium. Was auch immer ein Sudatorium ist. Expensive clothes. Belonging to one of the men from the steam room. Champagne. Hm? Champagne. For Champagne. a special occasion. Unopened. It was intended to be enjoyed after the steam session. Champagne for us. Das hatten wir schon. Okay. These clothes belong to one of the suspects from the steam room. Clothes belonging to one of the suspects. Ui! Drei Nacksche! Und Dauer! Good Lord, Holmes! Ah! Death with a peculiarly Roman piquancy. Like the one you almost had an hour ago. Hey, let us forget about that. Yeah. I should check this blood sample at Baker Street. Ooh. This key was covered in blood. I should ask Phillips about it. There was only one hit from the weapon. It pierced the right eye straight through to the brain. Death would have been instantaneous. Okay. Okay, okay. Look, Watson. He was wearing a ring. He very likely removed it before the steam session. Some dirt or earth. I'll take a sample. Uh... Hmm. The wound should not have bled so profusely. This pool is rather large. Uh... 
Noch irgendwas? Nö. Der Dicke, der hat Blut an seinem Ding. It's horrible. I can't talk at the moment. Du mich verarschen? I'm in shock. I don't want to talk. Du mich verarschen? It's horrible. So Rodney is dead. Can't we speak about it somewhere else? Hey, du willst mich doch verarschen, oder? The brazier is still burning. The heat here is extreme. I will need something to pick up this melted metal. It is too hot. I cannot reach into it. One lens is cracked, probably due to the temperature of the brazier. These lenses are for myopia. The wearer is short-sighted. Okay. With the steam on, I'm unable to see even a few feet away. So, how are good so? Vielleicht finden wir hier irgendwas. Nö. Äh. Febe, da. Ich brauche also etwas, um das Ding da rauszuholen. I cannot leave until I have seen the body. Ey, die haben uns doch schon angeguckt. Willst du mich verarschen? Hä? Alles angeguckt. Was soll das? What should we do next, Holmes? Ich verstehe das jetzt nicht. Es muss aber was mit dem hier zu tun haben. G. Newell and Sons, Steam Specialists, Seattle, WA. Wir benutzen das jetzt noch mal. Hat er noch eine Steam on. I'm unable to see even a few feet feet away. Ja, das hat doch nichts damit zu tun. Hm. Ich 
Oh, was soll ich hier denn noch untersuchen, bitteschön? LOL! I think we have found all that we can here, taking into consideration the abysmal lighting. Constable, we have finished with the body. We don't have many leads here. What concerns me is that we still have to find the murder weapon. Mr. Holmes? Please have the body removed without disturbing anything else in the room. All right, Mr. Holmes. I was wondering, Holmes, it's fairly reckless to carry out a murder inside a closed chamber. Why do you suppose they did it? There are a great many possibilities. The murderer was in a hurry. Or he is an artist. Or a ghost. Or he wanted to ensure that I'd be brought in on the case. Probably the latter. You are ridiculous. Do you know that? Genau. Und ob wir den Mörder finden, erfahren wir in den kommenden Folgen. Bis dahin bleibt entspannt. Genießt den Tag. Bye bye.